Hopeless, Fish, Rosenberg, Spider Woman, number 16. Jessica Drew is the master of multitasking. She's a single mom, a private investigator, and a superhero. Luckily, she has Daily Bugle reporter Ben Urit, reformed criminal Roger Gocking, also known as the Porcupine, to help her out with everything from dirty diapers to supervillains. Though Roger tried to leave his criminal life behind, he couldn't escape completely. Porcupine. The Porcupine was a franchise of the Hobgoblin. And this is the Hobgoblin. The thing about collecting comic books is you have the ones that you collect. And you have the ones that you read over and over and over, and you have the ones that you sell. I have a few comic books, quite a few, that I've never read. This falls into that category. So what you're seeing is also what I'm seeing for the first time. And I don't know if this is enough content to keep you tuned into my channel. I have a little more following <laughs> than... Uh, I had before so I'm still losing people due to content and maybe it's just not your your thing that's okay these are all the things that Jessica has pain and aches in her body because she's a very physical lady She reminds me a lot of myself <laughs> in some form. So some of her personality characteristics are very similar to me. But of course, she's more fantastically exciting and lives all kinds of different roles. I live vicariously through her. <laughs> that sounds stupid. Let me just figure out how to fly this stupid thing. So she jumps on his the hop, this letter with this says. Wouldn't it be neat if we had contraptions where we can fly everywhere? Like, you know, the skateboards from like Back to the Future or when, you know, they jump on those hoverboards. What is going on with my camera? Okay, Roger, I'm almost Ah, yes, almost, but as you can see, not quite. Ah, but not quite. Oh, no, oh, man, oh, oh, no, Roger. So, you know, they're struggling in the air to catch each other's hands. Crunch. Fuck. Thanks. Um, what's that? My monkey's on karmic retribution. <laughs> nice. This guy. I wish I had Scooby-Doo. I don't ever come across those. I came across Transformers the other day. I'm on my little 15 minute break. Uh, today's Tuesday. We've made it towards uh, the 3rd, March 3rd really don't have any designated uh, dates that I'm going to post videos um, and I don't imagine that you want to see one from me every day uh, I know if it's too uh, when I have too many videos that are popping up I end up having to silence them uh, take those notifications off um, but if I do miss a video I'll go and search uh, for that the YouTuber and go and watch that video. Um, I was just getting too many in my emails. It was just ridiculous. And I have a lot of people I'm subscribed to. 
That was such a cool comic. I love the way they added the colors to it. Blues and greens and yellows and oranges, my favorite colors. I really like them. So she falls in love with this porcupine thing. Porcupine guy. But this hog goblin, he kind of is he gets on your nerves. Look at look at their their face, their irritated faces. So I finally found a, a apartment to live, um, not too far from here, which I'm kind of happy about, about two miles, and I'm going to get me a P.O. box. I used to have one, so if I do continue doing the reselling biz, ooh, I am Groot. And I'm not going to read the rest of this. I tried to get this comic. I came across it like three or four times in the past. And every time I wanted to buy it, I just, I wasn't able to. And then I just stopped seeing it in the stores and I just decided not to buy it. When I went online, it was, it was a little pricey. So I was like, no, that's probably one of the ones I don't have. But I wanted it super bad. But now I don't collect them anymore. Now I'm just selling them. And that's the end of that comic. Um, so, I guess I'm gonna go. Oh, by the way, hold on. I was watching this one little short video, and if you ever followed the Briggertons, uh, the show that was on TV, I believe they have it on Netflix. You can't see this now, but. Um, it asked you to find out what your burger ten name is, and my name is Lady Ran Sea Salt Cream Coffee Ten of Devonshire. So, <laughs> and so they'll ask you to add Lady, and then your middle name, and then what the last drink was that you had, and then so this is what I had: sea salt cream coffee. And then add T-O-N at the end of that drink. And then the name of your street. And then Shire. So somebody did a little short online. It was just really cute. And so I played along. And I made a comment. And I just thought it was so cute. So if you haven't watched Burger Time, you should. It, was, it wasn't too bad. It was totally a chick of you. But yeah. Anyhow, I haven't watched the second um, series second season is what I mean yeah. okay I'm floundering here I'm gonna go ahead and get off I have no words today hardly so thanks for tuning in to blow up I appreciate you as always and uh, come back and visit and leave a comment for me thank you bye